Welcome again to All Things Gumball, where I wanted to talk to you about what it is that we give to the owners of the stores. You know, do we give them a percentage? And I always tell people, don't offer anything. Go in there, show them what you want to bring, and ask them if you can put your little vending machine inside their store. And I would say one out of 10, maybe one out of 15, will say yes. Okay, so if you say one out of ten, that means nine nine people will say no. You gotta talk to ten businesses before you finally get one person to say yes. Okay? And don't offer anything. Don't offer anything. Unless it looks just fantastic. You see a lot of cars in the parking lot. You want to see more than twenty cars in the parking lot. And then if they say, well what do we get out of it? Offer them. them. Offer them twenty percent of the gross. And that means when you pull out the money if there's a dollar, they get a quarter and you get four quarters. That's 20%. If they want more, offer them more. It's say 25% of the gross, of the of before profit. If they want 50%, what they're saying to you is I want 50% of the profits. In other words, if you spend a dollar, if you spend $100 on the candy and there's $200 then split the rest. So let's say you pull out the money, there's $200 in the machine, or if you have two or three machines, you pull out the money, you count it, there's $200. You put $100 worth of candy in the machine, so you're going to split the leftovers. You're going to split what's left over. $100 pays for your candy, and you split the profits. 50% goes to them, and 50% goes to you. And I wouldn't give them any more than that. If they say they want more, if they say they want 50% of the gross, two things are going to happen. You're either going to have to lower the amount of candy you give so much that the customers get pissed off, and they get mad, and they don't come back, okay? Or you're really not going to make very much money at all. You can try it this way, but you can walk away from a location. There's thousands of places that will take your vending machine. So don't don't fret. If it's a if it's a very big business like a big shopping center or something like that and you really want to be in there you're gonna make money you're gonna make money it's better to make a small amount of money in a big location than a large amount of money in a small location if you've only got five customers and and five employees they may be spending a lot of money there but it might be better to pay up to pay a percentage so don't don't feel bad if you're paying a percentage it'll it'll pay you back in the long run so I hope that helped on uh, this question about what to pay the what to pay the place when you look for a location as I said earlier as I said in the beginning of this video don't offer anything let them ask you know you're not you're you're if you work with the charity they're gonna feel bad that they're asking you for a percentage because they know that you're paying a percentage to the charity that you're working with if you walk in there and you say hi I'll tell you my charity my charity is the National Children's Cancer Society when I walk in and I say, hi, how are you doing? I'd like to talk to you about this little gumball machine I'd like to put in your store. And I work with this charity, and it helps this charity. And I tell them a little bit about what it does for the charity. And uh, if they're hesitant and they say, well, I don't know, you can offer. You can say to them, well, let me say this. I take out a certain amount of money that I pay to this charity. And if you like, every month I can come by, and I can give that amount to you if you want to give to another charity. If you want to give, let's say that you, let's say the store owner wants to, um, let's say he's in love with the SPCA, let's say. You've get, you go to a place that they do dog grooming or it's a veterinary care clinic. You know, you can say to them, why don't you offer this amount of money that I take, that I give to them, that I give to this charity. I could give it to you and you could donate it to the national, um, the, sorry, the SPCA. So that's another way to get your foot in the door, okay? But like I said, don't if somebody's if someone is too greedy and they want too much of your profits, walk away. It's not worth it. Anyway, thank you for watching this video. I hope you got something out of it. I hope you learned something from it. Uh, please subscribe. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video, and uh, hope you have a good evening. Please hang up and try again.